why I come up for a nice little quick nine holes here at the Pitch and Putt at Porter's Head Golf Club. Now, it used to be called the Hole in One. We had a really good chance of having a Hole in One because there's a lot of little funky holes there. Now I come out with a few old little bits and bobs in my bag. But I'm not being lazy, I just don't have the right equipment. Really bring the right club for this shot. I think I need about a seven iron. Trusty five wood, tightless little hickory stick thing on my knees. Take a little bit off it. Oh, it's a bit drawy. Little kick to the right, I think that's going to be all right. Good clubbing. That was it, with about that much to go. And it went left hand turn collide. That's a tap in. Course management skills are everything actually. You come in to this first hole, you have a look, you don't want to miss it right, because I tell you what, it's just going to ping down there. Watch this. You know, just a little bit of momentum, and all of a sudden, you're a country mile away. Got the thick bund on the left hand side there, and that's always a deterrent in it. Makes your knees go a little bit to jelly when you're over it. And this is one of maybe two or three bunkers that are on the whole golf course, and it's just not at the TLC it deserves. It needs a bit more sand in it. Sure. Better not waste any sand in this bunker, have I? Better put it back in. Yeah, I forgot, Porter's Head, it's full of pebbles, isn't it? Just like Pebble Beach. Yeah, there ain't no sand round here. Well, yeah, that's out of the window. Be nice to do up this golf course, make it look nice and presentable. While I'm down here, I thought I might as well reflect on life. Absolutely beautiful. There we go. Hey. Well, my footing went. Just totally hoiked it straight left, caught the trees, and well, it's come down in here on the pine straws. A bit like, well, Augusta really. Got a gap the size of about a football. Maneuver my golf swing around these because as soon as you break a limb, you incur a penalty. Don't get that pine needle between club and ball or it's going to go nowhere. Top shot, I was happy with that. The back of the second, I've actually found another little bunker. Little bit of sand, but that's due to a mole just poking his head up through the, the earth and uh, give me a little bit of a sand blast to have a go at. This is actually my granddad's. When I uh, started playing golf here and at uh, Ashton Court, this was his five iron. Yeah, go rest his soul. But he gave me the bug. He didn't let me have a mulligan either. He said, no, like it and lump it, get on with the game. That was his motto. Me, him and my dad, it was lovely. Never forget it. Got to go down to go up. Game of opposites, bunkers. Oh, he's played a beauty. Get over. Oh, Seve, Mickelson, you name it. I tell you what, you'd be proud of me on that one, wouldn't you? I hope so, because I'm proud of myself. Getting a good butcher's that. I thought I'd had a little bit more uh, zippity doo -dah. I got a little nervy one. You got to seal the deal in these moments. You really have. You youngsters out there, you boys and girls who want to take up the game of golf, this is what it's all about. Short game, short game, short game. Get out of jail free card. Might one day hold the claret jug. You just never know. Bad shot, bring it over. Bring it over. Yeah, yeah. Why not? Why not? Nice. Uh... Well, I've been gate crashed by my mate, Ashley Mansell, assistant professional at Clevedon Golf Club. He's actually just having a nice spot of food with his granddad, weren't you? I was, yeah, watching you hit a few chips. You've never played on here, have you? Never been there. What do you think when you have a look at this golf course for the first time then? On the coast, windy, small greens? Quirky, but um, it makes you play some creative golf. You know, you got to use your imagination. So. And I can't believe this is your first time here, you pup. Yeah. <laughs> what? First time still on it, as far as I can remember. Yeah. Oh. I mean, this boy, he can hit a golf ball. I mean, me and him have had a serious battle over the years. Yeah, I mean, you weren't born when that was made. Yeah, I got to show you some old clubs. I mean, look at that one, mate. That is the Anvil Gary Player Morrissey. Guaranteed to get you out of the sand. Serious loss. I can yeah. go. Uh, yeah. 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 I'm not sure with that one. That's my line. Right, now, this is my granddad's, right? This is my granddad's. I mean, when you look at that, do you just think, I can't believe they made a club like that? The old bladed putter. Look at that. Little leather grip. Look at that. It's not a bad club, is it? What a difference. 
the size of that. I'll well, put that up against Compared that. To that. There you go. There you go. Little and large. Yeah. Crazy. Tiny. You're going to take me on? Yeah, I'll take you on. Tell you what, I'm fired. I was shot the day that was, wasn't it? It's only just begun. I don't know, I like the grip. Bend those knees a little bit. Only a little. Straight in the middle. There we go. Hardly move the head. There you go, rhythm is a dancer. Good man, well done. That's what it's all about, boys and girls. This young man, only eight years old, Sonny, and I tell you what, he's absolutely munched it straight down the middle, and this is where it begins. In it, Sonny. Oh, well done, Sonny. Hands forward again, remember? That's it, there you go. Hey, I tell you what, good strike. On the green. On the fringe, come on, boss. I'll tell you what, that's got a chance, that's got a chance. What well I mean. Well, if you come down to Port's Head Golf Course, you're go. likely to see a bit more of me. I'm gonna be lurking around, you might pop my head out of a bush. I'm here to help, just like Sonny has seen, just hitting a few golf shots, and to a little bit more of an advanced player like Mitch, who's down here just having a little chipping lesson off me. So, all right, Mitch? Yeah. I mean, this boy, you know, started like five, six years ago. And what are you now? Two. Two handicap. Yeah. Would you? Less of that language, please. There's kids watching. Right. In the air, pitching back there. 